Working with folders on the iPhone is probably one of the most cumbersome things you can engage in when managing your iPhone's home screen. Let me show you why. Now fortunately there are jailbreak tweaks like Folder Enhancer, which I'm running here, which allows me to have pages of apps in folders, folders in folders, etc. So it makes the whole idea of using folders on the iPhone a lot better. But it still can be a little bit cumbersome. Now one of those things is to try to get rid of a folder easily. That's kind of tricky. Let me show you why. I'm just going to create a folder here. I'm just going to put my mail and my phone into this productivity folder. There it is. Now, if you wanted to actually remove this productivity folder, what would you have to do? Well, you have to go into the folder, put your phone in wiggle mode, and you have to move each app one by one outside of the folder, unless you had something like multi-icon mover, which makes it a little bit easier as well. But with this new jailbreak tweak titled Unfolder, all you need to do is put your phone into wiggle mode, and then you'll see a delete button next to that folder. All you do is tap that button. It'll ask you, are you sure you want to delete? Delete? And then bam, there you are. All your apps are outside of your folder and the folder is no longer there. And the other two apps went down here. So Unfolder is a great jailbreak tweak. It is free and it allows you to quickly get rid of folders that you no longer need, get all your apps outside quickly. You don't have to do the whole one by one shuffle thing. What's even better is that Unfolder is available on the default Cydia repos for free. So if this looks interesting to you, go ahead and download it and let me know what you think. This is Jeff with jailbreakmovies.com. Mobile Notifier. Hands down, it's one of the best looking, most functional tweaks available on the iPhone. It allows you to have notifications in any app and also allows you to do quick reply just like that. That's the newest update in Mobile Notifier. Check out this video.